messy hair because I've only, well, I've not long been up, but I've walked the dog and this hasn't done anything with my hair yet. Um, I thought I'd come on and show you another craft idea I'm doing. As you know, I love to show my craft ideas. This one is a picture, an old picture I had, which is that one from Pineland. I've turned it round. I've spray painted it and I've drawn a picture on of the Up house from the film Up. Um, it's a bit faint though at the minute. I will be making it a bit better. More detail so you can there. see it. I did spray paint it with some paint, but it's kind of, it's the pan and chalk paint and it seems to be coming off a bit. So I'm going to see how we go with that one. I might just have to literally just paint it with paint, but then I've got to redraw that again. Anyway, um, I've pe drawn it over. I will be going over this with a black paint pen. And then uh, I've done all the string for the balloons. And then what I'll be doing after that is I'll be getting a glue, glue gun, glue gun, and with the pound and pom poms, I'll be sticking them all over. So then, to the three D effect of all the balloons on the building, I will fast. What's not? It's not called flasmo, is it? I will time hop this so you can see me actually doing it and see the end result. So, yeah, that's my craft for today. Just with an old pound and picture that I don't want anymore. Hi, actually, I've decided to paint over the picture because the spray paint was just coming off every time I drew. So now I've painted it with the Magnolia Wilkinson's paint just there. So once that's finished, then I'll show you how I apply the pom-poms. <sighs> That is all completed. I've decided to shade um, the house, the colours of the house in. I went online and to see what colour the house was. And um, there it is. Love it. Hi, and I just wanted to run through another craft idea I've done, which is using the backs of the photo frames that you get from Poundland. I originally bought three photo frames because I was doing a um, lantern with just the frames building lantern you'll see the lantern on another one of my videos if you scroll back and obviously i had the backs left over and i thought what can i do with the backs don't want to just chuck them so i decided to do some designs on them that is the stranger things design i just used obviously the panland back in frame and then panland um acrylic paints i couldn't think of the name then panland acrylic paints and then I done that design. And then I done that design of the Rolling Stones, mouth and lips, mouth and lips, mouth and tongue. <laughs> um, and I put stuck all these little diamante stick-ons that you get from Poundland as well. I will show you them in a second. And then the last one I done is Beauty and the Beast. I was gonna say the Lion King. I tell you, I'm not, I'm not properly awake yet. I'm not long woke up. So yes, this is Beauty and the Beast. And I've just copied this design off the internet. I just typed in the silhouette Beauty and the Beast pictures. And I've drawn the outline of the lion and bell. And then I painted it black with the blue acrylics on Poundland and then gold. You could also do it white if you want to. And then again, I stuck these diamantes around it. And then it does some photo frames. Which I thought are really cool, which I'll put there. And there's the three photo frames. 
I'll just show you the sheet of, oh, it's actually called Gems. Design Gems from Poundland, self-adhesive. Design Gems. That's then you can get loads. So that's them. I also forgot, I also done a butterfly as well. I'm not too happy with that. I'm not very good at art, no, not at all. So I'm not totally happy with that. But I wanted to show you what the silver ones look like around the edge of the frame. So that's them. And then if you want, you can also do a design with pom-poms. I'm not going to show you just yet, with pom-poms all around it. You can get a pack of mini pom-poms or larger pom-poms from Powerland as well. Um, I've I done a design out of this and I'll show you that just now. Oh, just now. <laughs> As you can see, I've got it up in my fireplace. Um, I stuck pom-poms above the top bit as well. Uh, I coloured in the silhouette with a, sh well, you can't, I filled it in with a paint pen, but you can fill it in with a Sharpie as well if you want. And then I um, glue gunned the feathers on the bottom to make the skirt. And that is my pretty ballerina. So that's the end of my little crafting video. I hope you enjoyed it and you got some ideas of some things to do when you're a bit bored over the summer holidays or if you're in lockdown. Um, and I will see you all very soon for my next video. Bye. Stay safe, everyone.